About the only thing I would say about this practice swing is I'd like to see your left shoulder a little lower. Uh, you'll look at the still photograph at the end. You can see that it's a little higher than it should be. But other than that, what a sweet rhythm and tempo. Very nice. Nice smooth takeaway. Good rotation. Left knee's a little bothersome, but not bad. And you turned right through it. I'd like to see a little more action on the right leg. A lot of feet movement here. Uh, not very stable, but a pretty good leg drive. You try to have your hips thrust a little bit more towards the target. There goes your feet again, kind of dancing around. This is a great L to L drill. You did a you did a wonderful job of it. Great rotation, right back to the L. Nicely done. Watch the feet again. club gets a little too far to the inside and stays shut, you end up pulling the shot hard to the left. That's what's causing that. You'll see here how the, the left arm is so far away from your chest causing you to pull it. Again, now the club is too upright and you're coming a little over the top, which again sets up for another miss hit. In this case, you cut across and left the face open. Good posture, good setup. Keeping the club outside the hands, good move. Drop it back to the inside, turn it over. The only thing I see is I'd like to see a little bit more leg drive. Again, the club was outside your hands. Club face parallel to your lead arm. Now, the reason you chunked that a little bit is you didn't get your weight forward soon enough. Here we see nice posture. Spine pointing up to 1 o'clock. You're aimed a little right of where you really want to go. I think you're really wanting to go to the second barrel. You're aimed to the right of the first barrel. Good arm extension there. But right here, your arms are a little low. I'd like to see you get up above your shoulder height at least. And the ball went right to the first barrel. Good swing. Notice here that you haven't quite driven anything towards the front side. We need to drive those hips. Good stable rotation, solid platform. Great drive into the front side, but you straighten your knees up. See that? Both knees went dead straight on you. Good finish. See where they are? Kind of locked up. That should say leg drive, not left drive. Even on the three-quarter shot or the half swing, we want to get our weight to the front side prior to impact. It's still, you're still leaning back.
you're over the ball quite a long time. Nothing's moving. Okay, start to take away. Pretty good move here. Good shoulder rotation. Arm stayed pretty straight. Good hip drive, but again, your knees are locking up. Uh, we've got to keep the spring in those knees. Awesome finish, though. Thrust of the pelvis was forward. Good balance. You're ready to go. Good golf swing. Don't let that right knee straighten up. We want to keep the flex in our knee so we can drive through. Uh, notice that your hands are low and your knee is straight. Awesome posture. Good setup. Got your shoulder down nice and low here. Good setup. Absolutely perfect at the top of the swing. Nice little draw. Way to go. Very good. Hands are a little too far away from your body. The arm should be down more here. Try to get the hands to hang under your chin where they're more naturally. Big drive here with the legs. Very nice. A lot of power in that swing. Once again, the hands are out a little too far. Good motion. See a nice square setup. Clubs going back low and slow. A little too far to the inside, maybe, but not bad. Getting your chest parallel to your back foot. Drive down. Through into it. Uh, I'd like to see you stay a little lower on your backswing. You tend to raise up a little bit. And here we see that the right hip hasn't really rotated through. Nice stack and tilt move right there. Kept your shoulder right over the golf ball. Club straight down on it. Good divot. Obviously, you can see weight transfer. What I'd like to see is a little bit more hip rotation and a little bit more hand rotation here. Good rotation. Try to get that right toe down. A little putting stroke here. Watch the club kind of go to the inside a little bit here on the way through. And you hit it a little bit out on the toe. But all, all in all, a pretty good hit. Nice follow through. Again, a good weight transfer. Uh, later on in one of your videos, you'll see that you didn't get your weight forward. One of the picturesque views, third hole of Sunny Breeze. Nice high takeaway, a little over the top there. It'll cause it to go a little bit left on you. Good position there, though, huh? Look at the, look at the drive, look at the extension of the arms. Keeping the shoulders right over the ball, tilting a little bit, smash down on it, good extension. This is one of your better leg drives too. Nice job. Good extension there. Excellent.
See, now that time you didn't get your weight going forward at all, lost a little balance. That's where the club is after it hit the ground. We've got to get your weight to the front leg earlier. Let's build Baker out mowing. You can see you took the club way too far to the inside on the way back, creating an over-the-top move. Uh, it's a hard one to fix, but you can see right here how, how steep to the inside the club is. It's out inside your hands. And then on the way down, the hands are way out. So we need to kind of reverse those two pictures. Club face dead shut on the way back and over the top. And boom, off to the left it goes. Good takeaway. A little over the top, but not bad. I'd like to see a little more spring in those legs. See how stuck you look. A little more spring the legs, a little more uh, hip turn will be better. Hope to see you all next week, guys. Take care now.